The Library of Lost Souls. Anna loved books more than anything. She was a librarian at the Old City Library, a place that had been abandoned for years. She had found the key to the library in a dusty bookshop, and since then, she had been sneaking in every night to read the rare and ancient books that were stored there. One night, as she was browsing through the shelves, she heard a faint whisper in her ear. Help me, it said. She turned around, but there was no one there. She shrugged it off as her imagination and continued reading. The next night, she heard the whisper again. Help me, please, it said. This time, she felt a cold breath on her neck. She shivered and looked around, but still saw no one. She decided to ignore it and focus on her book. The third night, she heard the whisper louder and more urgent. Help me, or you'll be next, it said. She felt a hand grab her shoulder and squeeze it hard. She screamed and dropped her book. She ran to the door, but it was locked. She tried to open it, but it wouldn't budge. She banged on the door and shouted for help, but no, one heard her. She turned around and saw a figure standing in the shadows. It was a man, or what used to be a man. He had pale skin, sunken eyes, and a mouth full of rotten teeth. He wore a tattered suit and a name tag that said, John Librarian. He smiled wickedly and said, Welcome to the Library of Lost Souls. You're the newest addition to our collection. You'll never leave this place. You'll be trapped here forever, just like me and the others. He pointed to the shelves, and Anna saw that they were not filled with books, but with human skulls. Each skull had a name tag on it, with the name and occupation of the person. She recognised some of them as famous authors, scholars and historians. She realised that they were all people who had disappeared over the years and that they had all been librarians at this library. She screamed again, but it was too late. John grabbed her by the hair and dragged her to the nearest shelf. He took a knife from his pocket and slashed her throat. He placed her skull on the shelf and put a name tag on it. It said, Anna Librarian. He smiled and said, Welcome to the Library of Lost Souls. You're the newest addition to our collection. You'll never leave this place. You'll be trapped here forever, just like me and the others. He went back to his book and started reading. He heard a faint whisper in his ear. Help me, it said. He ignored it and continued reading.